Hey Lola's. So I'm here with baby, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know his name yet. I wanna be like, oh, his name is Gerard. His name is, he do look like a Gerard. Or maybe a, a Jared. Or, I don't know. People have been recommending names of, um, that I know people already have the names. So a lot of people recommended Jeremiah. A lot of people recommended Jace. Um, both names I know, uh, actually, customers of mine that have, um, their babies are those names. So I was like, ah, I can't do that. So, and I don't want to rename him something that somebody I've already used before. You know what I found out, though, about that when I reuse a name? That baby always leave. I, I had about five journeys. I had a ton of of Gabby's the only Gabby that has stayed is the real Gabby <laughs> and um, I'm sure when she gets 18 20 20 hopefully she stays till she's at least 21 but she'll eventually um, probably get married and uh, leave the house too but in a positive way um, but yeah, so I'm like, I don't know, I don't know. I still, I haven't been able to really like pinpoint a name for him. I'm thinking like, I thought about, I can do Gabe because we already got Gabriel's. I could do Gage, but I don't know. I don't know. I like the name Lyric. I have two people that I know have babies named Lyric. Um, so, nope, those won't work. <laughs> so, me and him has been on a journey with, you know, deciding what size I wanted him to be. I really wanted a baby that was going to be tiny enough, look at him, <laughs> tiny enough for me to get that newborn feel. But, um, big enough to where I can, you know, be able to put them in nice, a nice bit of clothes. I have a lot of zero to three and three to six month size clothes here. And it's like, I really, really loved when I had him on, which is the body that he's on now. Um... It was just a little overstuffed for his size. So I went in and I changed some weight around in his chest and in his arms. And so I'm very happy with, with him now. So I think this is how he'll stay. But man, it's crazy because I love him just in like even a t-shirt and diaper. So I got to think of a name. And he really, I think he really... Uh, you know the, the the cuddle bodies are so funny because although they they pose really nicely sometimes the movement can be a little crazy a little awkward but for me it's worth it because it's the the ultimate feel he just he wants to keep throwing that arm out no matter what I do um, uh, I can't wait to see him with hair, man. I, I gotta find some other places to buy hair to some more hair. Cause the people that I've used to buy from, they don't sell it anymore, but I really loved their quality of hair. It was very silky. It, you know how some mohair, when it dry, it looks dull and frizzy and, or poofy. No. The hair, the more hair that I was using before, it actually keeps a sheen. It looks wet when it's dry, and that's what I want. Um, but I don't, I don't know that I want to give him like a curly type hair. So, I don't know. I'm gonna tell you guys a secret too to what makes these babies feel so good. Um, even with your reborns when you're waiting them, what I learned that I like. A lot with them 
I love to give them almost like a bean bag feel. So I know a lot of people go crazy with the poly feel, but for me, I like to do more glass beads than poly feel. And so when I, when I feel his back, it just, it feels, it reminds me almost of a, of a bean bag, but you know, the way you feel the beads in that, and, all, and it just, I don't know, he just feels, he has a good weight and he just feels soft. And so I, I love that. So that's, that's my, my favorite feel. But I mean, I just love, I, I, I don't, I don't see how people could not love this hobby, like not love these dolls. I don't even see how, and I'm, I'm kind of judging, but I'm not judging. I'm just, you know, stating how I feel. But I also don't understand like how someone can like get these babies and like just, you know, put them in a box or put them on a shelf and never pull them out. Like I can understand keeping them in a, like a little glass case or something like that for display when, you know, just to keep them protected and when you're not interacting with them. But he has a little piece of fuzz on him. Um, but to just not hold them, I couldn't do it. Oh, my battery's dying. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We'll talk later. Bye-bye.